Hi guys, welcome back to Emerge Kenya TV. We appreciate you for coming and for your continued support. Thank you so much. For all our returning subscribers and viewers, you guys are awesome. If you are not subscribed to this channel, it would be an honor to have you. So please consider subscribing. So today guys, we're going to be showing you the Nairobi Western Bypass that is set for completion pretty soon. And our journey will start at Gitaru and Ed at Waka. Since the last time we showed you this project, there has been a lot of improvement and some changes. So we wanted to share with you. So please join us in the tour and watch till the end. We would appreciate that. Nairobi Western Bypass is a road that connects Kikuyu Town to Ruaka Town and completes the ring road around downtown Nairobi. Nairobi Western Bypass connects Northern Bypass at Ruaka to Southern Bypass at Gitaru Kikuyu. Please remember to like this video to share it, to leave us a comment down below at the comment section and if you're new here, don't wait any longer, please subscribe. Nairobi Western Bypass is a four-lane dual carriageway with five interchanges at Gitaru, Ruakabete, Wagigi, Kihara, and Lumenji. We would like to hear from you what your thoughts are on this project. Please let us know at the comment section and we would appreciate that. The original design of the Western Nairobi Bypass had to be modified since it had interchanges also at Dederu and Ruaka. The 15.3 km project was the missing link of the ring road around Nairobi city and is projected to improve access to markets while increasing ease of doing business and improving real estate growth in Nairobi.
This project is under the supervision of Kenya National Highway Authority, also known as Kenha, and is being constructed by the China Road and Bridge Corporation. This project has been under construction since March of 2019 and is projected to be completed pretty soon. The project is being funded by the China Exim Bank. Still, pedestrian barriers are now being set up in busy places to ensure pedestrians don't cross the highway at non-designed areas. The Nairobi Western Bypass project includes also 17.3 kilometers of service road, noise control barriers around residential neighborhoods. A bus park at Wangige will also be set up to enhance public transport. We didn't notice this, but the design allows for a separate footpaths and cycle tracks for safety of other road users. Thank you so much for watching, we really appreciate you. Until next time as we bring you more content, have a great day, stay blessed and cheers.